And with all the storms that we are seeing now, it could potentially cause distress and fear for many pets. News 19's Aaron Walker went to a local animal rescue to meet with the experts to talk about the steps you can take to keep your pets safe and calm. As rain falls over the course of several days, a flooding danger exists. As people take steps to be safe in the waterlogged areas, there's also consideration for pets during these storms. Um, animals' ears are super, super sensitive. Um, they can hear things that we can't hear. So a thunderstorm can be a few miles away. You're going to start to see them get up. They're going to start pacing back and forth. They're going to seem like they're worried. Taylor Adams is the Community Outreach Coordinator at Pets Inc. in West Columbia. He says thunderstorms can trigger anxiety in pets due to loud noises, flashing lights, and changes in atmospheric pressure. We need to make sure that we're there for them. They show it differently, but we need to make sure that we take the time out to show them the same type of affection so that they feel that they're loved and are relaxed. Forrest has been at Pets Inc. for almost a year now. Whenever it storms, Adam says the loud outdoor sounds frighten him and the other animals. The solution is simple though. Turning the TV up just a little bit or turning the radio up just some, a little bit more so it's drowning out the loud noises. Other strategies pet owners can use to calm their animals include allowing your pet an inch closer to you on the couch to feel safer and then there's products like a thunder vest. The thunder vest, those work really well. The reason that those work um, it's because it's like somebody holding them and cuddling with them. Reporting in West Columbia, Aaron Walker, News 19, WLTX. By the way, Pets Inc., they have a number of pets waiting to be adopted. For details on how to do that, go to our website, WLTX.com, and look for this story.